birthday, so we're building a birthday team in Madden. I have a wheel here with all 365 days on it. We're gonna spin this wheel, put a team, put it in Madden, and see if we can go to a Super Bowl. First up is gonna be November 20th. Okay, we actually have a couple of options here. Zach Martin is probably who I'm going with, though. And I don't wanna bore you guys, so I'm not gonna pick every single offensive lineman, so we'll just take the whole Cowboys offensive line. Well, October 26th. I don't think any of these players are in the NFL except for Sha Smith, so I guess he'll be one of our wide receivers. Hopefully, it will be our wide receiver three. January 17th. Don't recognize any of these players but this guy is 28 so he might still be in the nfl darius harris what position does he play linebacker okay well i guess he's gonna be our starting linebacker first defensive piece isn't the best hopefully we'll get some better this time uh, august 22nd oh my god we have a max a crosby october 22nd let's go that makes up for the last thing we just got next is a may birthday it looks like may 18th devin harper james hudson i really don't know oh we got tyron matthew actually we're picking up tyron matthew that's a huge w as well we're low-key building Building a really good team right now. Can we uh, keep it up? October 2nd, and there is nobody really that I know. I'm just going to pick one. Let's just take this running back, I guess. Next up, it looks like a September 3rd. I feel like I'm opening like card packs and really hoping that we pull somebody good. We have a lot of active players for their birthday, but we can't pick a lot of them because we already have offensive linemen set in our running back set as well. So let's go with Miles Jack out of Pittsburgh, I guess. We're not getting really any like decent players. They're either a huge hits or like really bad misses. But next up, June the 10th. KJ Osborne might be the one we go with here. Yeah, it probably is. So our wide receiver core so far is Shaw Smith and KJ Osborne. I'm really concerned that we haven't got a quarterback yet. September 23rd. AJ Terrell will be a huge pickup as well, and that's probably who we're gonna go with here. Next up. November 22nd. Uh, nobody really uh, all that great. We're probably gonna go with Trey McBride here, I guess. I did have hope for our team, but I'm not gonna lie. It's absolutely cooked now. Like, we need star players from here on out if we wanna make anything out of this season. We have another July birthday, July 7th. Again, we don't have any players that can help us out. Defensive lineman, uh, Kyrus Tonga. We still need two cornerbacks, so two defensive linemen, a wide receiver one, and a quarterback. Please, God, give me somebody good. February 20th. I'm not taking and Ryan Miller as my wide receiver one. So we're going to have to take one of these corners. I guess we'll take Isaac yet yield them or something i mean the exact day today march 25th at least it's still march though. Daniel mosley is kind of a w i have to go with emmanuel mosley next up we have march 14th okay we're in a bad situation can't take a running back so we have to take montreal washington for our last wide receiver i literally don't have any other choice another march birthday march 1st no, we have Jamar Chase now. Oh my God. Why the birthday closer to Jamar Chase and we can't even take him because our wide receiver core is filled and Tyreek Hill as well. No, this was literally worst case scenario, bro. Well, we can take Cansey's. We'll probably take Cansey instead, actually. This actually hurt. We only have two more spots to field it as quarterback, defensive end, and next is August 3rd. We don't have a defensive end, so we have to take our quarterback. Our two options are Zach Wilson and Tyrod Taylor. I would think Zach Wilson is rated higher we'll take him this is literally the worst ever luck i've had during a challenge our offense just straight up sucks besides of our offensive line honestly our defense actually looks pretty good our linebacker core not the best our defensive backfield is actually really good we're gonna hop in this first game because i want to see if i can even do something with this offense i guess the only player i could throw to is trey McBride. we almost threw an interception the very first play go zach go zach Yes, sir. Dot. It's Trey McBride on the sideline here for a pretty decent game. From about the five-yard line, we're in for a touchdown. I'm taking my hands off the controller, and we're going to see what our team can do by itself. Let's send to the midseason mark and see where we're at then. At the halfway point, we're actually 4-2. and two. How in the heck are we 4-2 and two with this team? Zach Wilson only has 1,400 passing yards, which isn't great, but I guess isn't bad either. It just looks like they decided to put Miles Sanders in for some reason. Let's advance the rest of the season and see if we end up making the playoffs. At the end of the season, we went 9-8. and eight. Well, they had me in the first half but we still actually made it to the playoffs somehow zach wilson had 2389 yards which is 31st in the league Miles sanders didn't have a thousand yards rush yeah osborne actually did have a thousand yards received let's hop into this wild card matchup against the cowboys and see how it goes at halftime we're down 24 to 7 34 to 7 yeah i think that's gonna be it it's 41 to 7 okay can they just end the game please thank you we didn't really go anywhere in the playoffs but like i said we made it with this team that's actually pretty good i can go with that thanks for watching everybody i hope you enjoyed